What's going on gamers? It's your boy Launchpad 1412. Excited to bring you some more Madden 13 gameplay. Got a commentator versus commentator showdown right here. Going to get Z Mink. Um, yes, yeah, I found him one uh, and through another person's channel, through Forrest Gump's channel. Actually, I seen the game when he played Forrest Gump. I was like, you know what? Let's, let's try. I tried to get a game with him. He actually hit me up. We ended up getting the game in. This is actually our second game. The first game that I played him he beat me 35 to seven. He was without question one of the better commentators I've. I have played against much respect. You no, know, he's up four touchdowns, and I was getting ready to go to bed. So I was like, let's run one more, you know, before um, I go to bed or whatever. You know, so um, we end up stopping the game, and now uh, we end up commencing the classic. Yes, this is a classic right here. Put it in the books. This is another classic that your boy Launchpad fourteen twelve is, is giving you. I gave you guys a lot of classics over this uh, year. Hope you guys enjoyed all of them. This is another one I know you're going to enjoy. He has the ball first. He has the Cleveland Browns, and I have the Carolina Panthers. You know, I figure I try to pick a team that's a um, little bit around the, uh, the Cleveland Browns, and you know the Panthers are a little bit better, but you know they're not that much better. So I said, hey, why not? Check this out right here. I ended up baiting him and throwing this interception right here. Oh my goodness. Woo. He even said it sucks that I baited him. He gave me props on the bait. Now I have the ball. I have a chance to make the first strike of the game to score 0 to zero, 0. Let's see what I can do. Let's go. I'm giving him a little bit of run, a little bit of pass, as you, as you can see. I want to mix it up. I want to see what I can do against his defense. I want to see what works better. In this game, both was working pretty efficiently, but I, I did end up starting running the ball more. But check this out right here. Get a nice play to the left right here. Third wide receiver on the on the Carolina Panthers depth chart. As I'm getting this touchdown right here, making the score seven and nothing. And I, I'm up and I'm feeling good because you know I'm, I, I wasn't never ever leading in the first game that we played. I played against him, but check this out right here. He has Josh Johnson again. Look what this nut is doing, man. I was like, yeah, I could not believe. <laughs> I couldn't believe he got that off. Did that a couple times to me. And check out this pass right now. I got to go up against this guy who has it, who is very fast. Fast quarterback, as he gets his touchdown right here, making the score seven nothing. Fast quarterback and Trent Richardson that can catch and run. He just being, he just Trent Richardson just gave me absolute. Uh, man, he just gave me just all kinds of pain this game, man. He, he was um, a problem, man. Two minute warning right here. I'm trying to get the ball down the field before half. You know, coming down the field, I'm doing a pretty good job. I get a pass right here to the Angel Williams. He breaks a tackle. I think it's the second tackle he broke on the game. He gets this nice big game. I thought I was going to score, but he ends up tackling me. Uh, second and goal right here. Not exactly the next play, but it's uh, the second to next play. After that, nice big one by D'Angelo uh, Williams. I end up getting a touchdown right here with Jonathan Stewart off of the nice juke right there. And uh, I'm feeling good. You know, the score is 14 to 7. It's great going to half. And check this out. I could not believe this guy got this off. I couldn't believe it. I just I, I, I couldn't believe. That he got uh, that touchdown right there, you know. I was like, wow, you know what I mean. But it's halftime right here. Sorry for my uh, my recorder it was acting a little funny right there. If um if some sounds a little blank, but yeah, <laughs> but yeah, he ended up getting that touchdown, and it's halftime right here. But you know, I'm feeling good. You know, it's 14 to 14 right now. I'm thinking right here, I, I got to score. But check this out, man. Play action fake, and I end up throwing this interception right here, man. This is exactly what you don't want to do when you're playing against uh, um someone that's really good, man. Because it doesn't matter what team they have, you know. They still are, are good Madden players, and Zeke Mink, Mink is that. Now he's coming down the field now. He has a chance to get a score and, and, and take the lead. And I'm thinking to myself, all I'm thinking about right now is this pick. But guess what, man? I end up getting an interception of my own right here. I end up getting this interception. And I take it back for six. So I, <laughs> I wish I could. I wish I could have took that back for six. But I, now, but now I'm feeling real good. You know, I just got an interception. It's actually my second pick of the game. The score is 14-14. I have a chance to take the lead. Let's see what your boy launch pack can do. Drag right the route right there for the first down to Steve Smith. And uh, I actually did two of those in a row. And check out this nice run right here by DeAngelo Williams, man. He was just causing havoc this game. Him and Trick Richardson, man, just, just being a beast, man. I thought he was going to break that tag when I was going to get a nice big game. Man. I was so hoping that was going to happen. But I'm coming down the field, you know. I'm passing the ball. I'm running the ball. You know, I got to figure out a way to get this score. This is a score I needed. Like the um, curling route right there to Steve Smith. Steve Smith had a very solid game. Played big, man. Played, played really very, very well, you know. He kept me in the game. Him and D'Angelo Williams. Oh, look at the juke right there, man. Look at this, man. I ended up getting the touchdown right there. Making the score 21 to 14. And I'm feeling good right now. And I'm feeling really good because it's late in the game. I have a touchdown. Let's see what the boy Zeke Mink can do. Can he counter that and tie this game up? Let's see what happens, man. It gets a nice. Look at this. Look at this. 
I'm just like, man. So I, I, I just, you see, I try to hit stick up, man. I, I try to take him out of the game. <laughs> I try to take him out of the game, man. The, the guy Josh Johnson just called too much havoc. But check this out, man. I end up getting a computer pick right there, and now I'm feeling real good, man. I'm feeling good until this happens. Look at that, man. The very next play. What a crazy turn of, of events that fast. And now I'm giving this solid man opponent another shot to uh, to tie the game up, man. You know, and, you know. And I, I'm not even mad at D'Angelo Williams. I know he gave me a fumble a game because he's been playing a, such an excellent game. And check this out, man. He dives in for the touchdown right here, making the score 21 to 21. I actually wasn't that mad because okay? you know he's been playing a good game, man. You know, I, everybody makes a mistake. I guess he was bound to make one. But now it's up to your boy, man. Can your boy, you know? Your boy 14-12. I've been in plenty of these games. Won some, lost some, you know. You never know how this is going to go. These games are going to go. These games are tight games. It's anyone's game. Can I come down here and, and, and commence uh, a game when it field goal or a touchdown? Let's see what happens. Check this out. I showed you guys this because it's very rare that I do Harry. You guys have played me before. You know, I don't do this. The draw worked pretty good the first time. So I was like, so I was like you know what? Let me try it again, you know. Sometimes you got to do some things differently. And uh, Zink, Zink Mink is calling timeout. I get a nice curling route right here. The Steve Smith big play right here as the time is running out of the game. And now, can I make this field goal and not get it blocked? Yes. <laughs> yes. Man, it felt so good to get this victory as he tries to heave right here. It felt so good to get this victory because he had blew me out, like I said before, by, by four touchdowns. And um, he's a very solid opponent, one of the more solid opponents that I've played, man. Um, I got much respect for him, so, you know, it was nice to get this victory. Shout out to Z Meek. If you haven't checked out his channel already, check it out right now. If you like his channel, hit the subscribe button and tell him that your boy Launchpad 12 sent you. Let's check out some of these stats right here. Cam Newton putting in work. D'Angelo uh, Williams had a big game uh, rushing and passing, man, just putting in work. I know uh, Johnson Stewart had somewhat of a solid running game, too. I think he had the most yards in this game. Yes, I was right right there, as you can see. And um, I know he had the uh, most yards and the most to carry. It's one of the two, you know. <laughs> and, um, yeah, these are the stats. And, uh, you know, shout out to Zing Ming one, one more time, man. I'm looking forward to playing him again. Shout out to all my subscribers, great subscribers on the planet. This is your boy, 1412, and I'm out.